freely slip and fall accident attorneys. Accidents are unpredictable and slip and fall incidents are no exception. These accidents can lead to a range of injuries, from minor bruises to severe fractures, impacting your quality of life and financial stability. In such trying times, the expertise of a Greeley slip and fall accident attorney becomes invaluable. Causes of slip and fall accidents. Slip and fall accidents can happen for various reasons, often due to hazardous conditions like wet floors, uneven surfaces, inadequate lighting, or obstructions in walkways. It's crucial to understand that these incidents can occur in any setting from commercial properties to private residences. Common injuries resulting from slip and falls. From sprains, strains, and contusions to more severe injuries like head trauma, fractures, or spinal injuries, the spectrum of possible harm is wide-ranging. Immediate medical attention is paramount, even if injuries seem minor initially. Documenting the extent of injuries is not only crucial for your health, but also serves as essential evidence in building a strong legal case. Legal Aspects of Slip and Fall Cases One of the key legal principles in slip and fall cases is premises liability. Property owners have a legal duty to ensure their premises are reasonably safe for visitors. When a property owner fails in this duty, they may be held legally responsible for any injuries that occur as a result. In the context of slip and fall cases, the duty of care refers to the responsibility property owners have to exercise reasonable care in maintaining their premises. This includes conducting regular inspections, promptly addressing any hazards, and taking necessary precautions to prevent accidents. Why you need a Greeley slip and fall attorney. Navigating the legal complexities of a slip and fall case requires a deep understanding of personal injury law. An experienced personal injury attorney brings this expertise to the table, ensuring that your case is handled with precision and thoroughness. A seasoned Greeley slip and fall accident attorney has access to a network of professionals who can bolster your case. This may include accident reconstruction experts, medical specialists, and investigators. They can reconstruct the incident, provide expert testimony, and ensure that all aspects of your case are thoroughly examined. Steps to take after a slip and fall accident. Seek medical attention. Document the scene. Gather witness information. How to choose the right attorney. When selecting a Greeley slip and fall accident attorney, prioritize experience in personal injury law. Look for a track record of successful cases similar to yours. Feedback from previous clients offers insights into the attorney's professionalism and effectiveness. Reading reviews and testimonials can provide you with a sense of what it's like to work with them. Choose an attorney who prioritizes clear and regular communication. They should be accessible to address your concerns and provide updates on the progress of your case. Maximizing your compensation. Ensure that all medical expenses related to the accident are thoroughly documented. This includes hospital bills, medication costs, rehabilitation expenses, and any future medical needs. If the slip and fall incident resulted in missed work days, you may be entitled to compensation for lost income. Non-economic damages, such as physical pain, emotional distress, and loss of enjoyment of life are also factors in determining compensation. Frequently Asked Questions FAQs How long do I have to file a slip and fall lawsuit in Greeley? In Greeley, Colorado, the statute of limitations for filing a slip and fall lawsuit is generally two years from the date of the incident. What if the accident was partially my fault? 
Colorado follows a modified comparative fault system. If you are partially at fault for the accident, your compensation may be reduced proportionally. How much does it cost to hire a slip and fall attorney? Most slip and fall attorneys work on a contingency fee basis, meaning they only get paid if you win your case. This arrangement allows access to legal representation without upfront costs. What if the property owner claims they were unaware of the hazard? Even if the property owner claims ignorance of the hazard, they may still be held liable if it can be proven that they should have known about it through reasonable diligence. Can I still pursue a case if I didn't seek immediate medical attention? While seeking prompt medical attention is crucial, not doing so immediately after the accident doesn't necessarily negate your case. It's still possible to pursue a claim, but it may require additional medical documentation and expert testimony to establish the link between the accident and your injuries.